My son is seven years old. Aaron Van Riper knew the casualties would be bad when he saw the wreckage of this car Saturday. The looks of that car, the fact that they're alive, is a feat. God has, has some amazing things for him, I'm, I'm, I'm guessing. Van Riper, the assistant fire chief with the Thomas Lake Volunteer Fire Department, responded to that crash near Riverside on FM 980 near Lakeland Road, not knowing it was his wife and seven-year-old son inside. It's my family, and my wife was laying there on the ground, and the look of the car, I don't know how either one of them lived. I mean, there was nothing left of that car. Amber Van Riper was ejected, their son Jonathan still pinned inside. Aaron, acting on adrenaline and years of training, tried to focus. Once I saw my son, that kind of went out the window, and I, I started going into a little bit of a panic mode. The Huntsville Fire Department was able to get the boy free. Both were rushed by life flight to Memorial Hermann Hospital. Amber was in surgery for nine hours yesterday. Her pelvis broken in five places. Wife, Only this, this morning, morning did she show improvement. She gave a thumbs up to the doctor, but that's the first time that she showed any signs of anything. Jonathan, or Bear as they call him, has a broken leg and arm. Though Amber works full time, the family has no insurance. Friends have launched this GoFundMe page to help with mounting medical bills. Van Riper is thankful. Oh, I don't want anything for free. I don't expect anything. If people are willing to donate, that's awesome.